U.S. Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense System versus China's HQ-9. In a world that is becoming increasingly complex, the need for effective defense mechanisms has never been greater. Two global powers, the United States and China, have been investing heavily in advanced missile defense systems to protect their respective interests. One such system hailing from the United States is the Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense System, a naval and land-based platform renowned for its adaptability and accuracy. On the other side, China offers its own robust system, known as the HQ-9, with naval and land variants aimed at securing Chinese interests in various theaters. The importance of comparing these two systems goes beyond simple military rivalry. Understanding their capabilities, limitations, and strategic implications can provide insights into broader geopolitics and the evolving balance of power. This article will break down these two critical systems, evaluating them across various parameters, including technological capabilities, adaptability, and overall strategic implications. The U.S. Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense System The Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense System Aegis BMD, is an evolution of the Aegis Weapon System, which was initially developed by the United States Navy to provide air and missile defense for naval vessels. Over time, its functionality expanded to include ballistic missile defense capabilities, now equipped with an array of advanced radar systems and interceptors. At the core of the Aegis system is the N SPY-1 radar, an electronically scanned array radar capable of tracking more than 100 targets simultaneously. The system also incorporates the standard Missile 3 SM3, interceptors, which are designed to neutralize enemy missiles in the mid-course phase of their trajectory. The Aegis BMD has proven its capability in both simulated tests and real-world operations, becoming the backbone of U.S. Navy's anti-missile defense. One of the most significant advantages of the Aegis BMD is its adaptability. The system can be deployed on various platforms, including destroyers, cruisers, and even onshore sites, offering a versatile defense solution against both traditional and emerging threats. China's HQ-9 The HQ-9, H-O-N-G-Q-I-9, is China's primary long-range air defense missile system. Designed and manufactured by China Aerospace Science and Industry Corporation, CASIC, it was developed to provide China with a modern, indigenous missile defense capability. Over the years, the system has been upgraded to include anti-ballistic capabilities as well. The HQ-9 features advanced phased array radar systems and can intercept targets at altitudes up to 27 kilometers. While it is primarily considered a surface-to-air missile SAM, system, its extended range variants are capable of anti-ballistic missile roles. The system uses a combination of inertial guidance and active radar homing to engage targets, offering a multi-layered defense network. The HQ-9 is not as adaptable as the Aegis system but has seen deployment in various configurations including land-based launches and naval vessels, such as the Type 052D destroyer. The system has been exported to other nations and has been deployed in different terrains, demonstrating a certain level of adaptability and operational flexibility. Comparative Analysis – Technological Sophistication The Aegis BMD system is the fruit of years of research, development, and iterative upgrades by the United States. At the core of its prowess is the N SPY-1 radar. Unlike traditional radar systems that are mechanically steered, the AN SPY-1 radar is electronically steered. This feature allows it to search, track, and guide missiles to multiple targets concurrently. Its quick reaction time and high output enable it to counter sophisticated anti-ship missile threats and ballistic missiles. The standard Missile 3 SM3, interceptor further bolsters the Aegis system's capability. The SM-3, specifically tailored to counter ballistic missile threats, destroys targets using kinetic energy, akin to hitting a bullet with another bullet. Advanced targeting and propulsion systems make mid-course interception possible, neutralizing threats before they re-enter the atmosphere. On the Chinese side, the HQ-9 system is no slouch, representing the pinnacle of China's air defense technological evolution. While its primary role is to serve as a long-range surface-to-air missile SAM, its extended range versions have integrated anti-ballistic capabilities. The HQ-9's radar system is an advanced phased array setup, allowing for concurrent tracking of multiple targets. However, when compared to the Aegis BMD, the HQ-9 does seem to play catch-up in the anti-ballistic missile role. It lacks the sophisticated mid-course interception capabilities of the SM-3 and is traditionally geared more towards aerial targets like aircraft and cruise missiles. While the system is formidable, especially in its indigenous development context, 
it does not offer the same multi-layered ballistic missile defense capabilities present in the Aegis system. Comparative Analysis, Adaptability and Flexibility The Aegis BMD's adaptability is arguably one of its greatest strengths. Initially designed as a sea-based system for the US Navy's cruisers and destroyers, it has evolved to accommodate various other platforms. Today, the Aegis BMD isn't restricted to the sea. The Aegis Ashore program has successfully installed the system in land-based configurations, broadening its protective reach. This multi-platform deployment capability means the system can be used in various theaters and scenarios. Additionally, Aegis BMD's interoperability stands out. The US Navy's ability to integrate the Aegis system with other defense systems, as well as operate cohesively with allied forces using the system, provides a cohesive and layered defense matrix. Allies such as Japan and South Korea, equipped with Aegis platforms, can collaborate more effectively in joint defense operations. The HQ-9, while adaptable to an extent, has a narrow operational band. Its primary design revolves around being a land-based system, although there are naval variants that have been integrated onto China's advanced warships, like the Type 052D destroyer. The HQ-9's strategic importance lies in its ability to protect key Chinese assets from aerial threats. Its adaptability does not seem to match the scope of the Aegis BMD. However, what it lacks in flexibility, it makes up for in integration with other Chinese defense systems. As a piece of China's broader air defense puzzle, the HQ-9 works in tandem with other systems to create a formidable defensive web. Conclusion While both the US Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense System and China's HQ-9 are formidable, they serve different strategic objectives and have different levels of technological sophistication and adaptability. The Aegis system is more adaptable and technologically advanced, making it a versatile tool in the US military arsenal. The HQ-9, while not as versatile, fulfills China's strategic goals and offers a solid defense capability for a range of scenarios. Understanding these systems is crucial for assessing the evolving balance of power and the broader geopolitical landscape. As tensions rise and the world becomes more interconnected, the role of these defense systems will only grow in importance, shaping the contours of global stability for years to come. Until next time, take care.